Hello everyone, and welcome to my sister wives bombshell channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Michael T. Brown Padrone, star of Sister Wives, and her family made their big move at last. Michael T. and her husband Tony have been clear for some time now that they intend to relocate their family from Utah to North Carolina. Janelle Brown visits Maddie Brush and her family frequently. They both reside in North Carolina. Consequently, the state was very appealing to the Padrones. Michael T. Brown Padrone found Utah to be very appealing, but she and her family are searching for new chances. The family has since moved to North Carolina, a great distance from the rest of the Brown family. Christine Brown currently resides in Utah with her new spouse, David Woolley. Cody and Robin Brown, meantime, are still residents of Flagstaff, Arizona. We are now residing in North Carolina. With a cute video of her twin sons connected, Michael T posted on Instagram with the hashtag hashtag Norigrits. Fans encouraged the Padrones in the comments section, despite the fact that they haven't yet said anything about why they decided to relocate. Instagram users posted, Ear I love how much fun the boys are having Red Heart. A best decision I've ever made. They will now have young cousins to raise Red Heart. A greetings from NC. It's the world's greatest place to raise kids hugging face. How fantastic. Mama is probably going to move shortly as well. The infants are really, really cute. More adorable than the other. A Redditor wrote, A Cody's nightmare of the family moving to NC is coming true to Hartstutt. Some people mentioned that Cody had gotten upset with his family for relocating to the state. While Isabel, Savannah, Janelle, and other family members have made extended stays there, Maddie and Kayla Brush are the only permanent residents. Given that Michael T. Brown and her husband Tony appear to get along well with Cody and Robin, the family patriarch will probably be very disappointed by this move. Some speculate that a spin-off of Sister Wives that centers on Michael T. and Maddie's southern escapades may be in the works. It will take time to see what this significant change means for the show's future. Regarding Michael T. Brown Padrone's relocation to North Carolina, what are your thoughts? Is a spin-off of Sister Wives in the works? Michael T. Padrone, star of Sister Wives, and her husband Tony Padrone had been considering relocating to North Carolina. They and their three children used to live in Utah. It appeared like the family had a quiet life until Michael T. made it clear that this wasn't the truth. The reality star clarified that she intended to leave Utah in order to get away from their drama e in her family. Although it's unclear who is involved in this drama, the Brown family is accustomed to it. Their children are most impacted by the significant changes in their family relations during the past few years. Michael T. had previously stated that they would be relocating to North Carolina shortly. Have they now moved into their new house? What's the most recent? Let's investigate. During a live YouTube video, Michael T. and her husband Tony Padrone revealed that they are relocating from Utah to North Carolina. The Sister Wives duo explained the migration in detail on their Patreon page, citing Tony's acquisition of his ideal position as a chess instructor as the main driver behind it. Michael T. also expressed her desire to live alone and escape the drama. In response to fan inquiries concerning the timing of the relocation, Michaelit has sent an update. Michael T. recently announced on Instagram that they had officially relocated to North Carolina. Our new home is in North Carolina. Along with a cute video of her twin sons, Ace and Archer, she captioned the post with the hashtag hashtag Norigrits. Fans of Sister Wives shouldn't be shocked by the news, as Janelle Brown recently stated on Instagram that she was assisting Michael T. and Tony with their relocation. Fans responded to the article with great enthusiasm, with one of the best comments noting, a best pick ever. They will now have young cousins to raise. A welcome to NC, said a second comment. It's the greatest spot on earth for raising kids. Notably, Michael T. had previously disclosed that the expensive a move to North Carolina had forced them to sell their Utah house. Regarding their old residence, there hasn't been any news though. Michael T., the star of Sister Wives, said her mother Christine Brown farewell as well when she departed her Utah residence. Tony landing his ideal career played a big part in her family's decision to relocate. Oh influenced by certain personal concerns she has been addressing to ING if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update. 
in North Carolina and permitting Michael T. to work from home for her sales position. She also desired a more environmentally friendly setting and to be away from family strife. Michael T. acknowledged that the relocation was ALS. After Christine and Cody separated, the reality star moved to Utah to help her, but now that Christine is happily married, Michael T. feels it was time to move on. She also desired a life that was more independent. More family members, including her cousin Maddie, live in North Carolina, giving her kids additional playmates. Growing up in the Brown household wasn't always easy for Gwendolyn Brown, the daughter of sister wives star Cody Brown and his third wife Christine Brown. The Brown family resided in one house at the time of the unscripted series 2010 debut. Cody resided in a spacious Utah home built for a polygamous household with his three wives and all of their combined children. When the family relocated into four different homes and welcomed a fourth wife, Robin Brown, everything changed. 22-year-old Gwendolyn grew up watching television. She was just nine years old when Sister Wives made its debut. Despite enjoying her large family life, Gwendolyn found it difficult to always obtain her father's attention. She had 17 siblings. Even before the COVID-19 epidemic permanently split the family apart, they were already apart. The first of Cody's spouses to leave him was Gwendolyn's mother, Christine, and three more would come after. Discover what Gwendolyn has been up to after her family's public dissolution by reading on. Between 1990 and 1994, Cody married his first three spouses in a short period of time. However, it would take him another 16 years to marry Robin and welcome her three children from a prior marriage into the family. Cody's child count rose to 18 as he and Robin welcomed two more children. Some of Cody's older children became resentful of his neglect as a result of so many people requiring his time. Christine's decision to part ways with Cody left Gwendolyn firmly on her mother's side. Gwendolyn, a bisexual, tied the knot with Beatrice K. Raz in Arizona in the summer of 2023. There are more Brown family members who identify as LGBT besides Gwendolyn. Leon Brown, her elder sibling, is a transsexual guy, aged 28. As season 19 of Sister Wives approaches, it's probable that Gwendolyn will make another appearance in the unscripted series. Despite her distance from her father, the cast member of Sister Wives stays in touch with her siblings. Despite their desire to avoid polygamy in their own lives, the majority of brown children frequently express their gratitude for having so many sisters and brothers when growing up. Mary Brown, star of Sister Wives, is not interested in listening to those who are upset over her son Leon. Leon Brown used to be a regular cast member of Sister Wives, but they have since left the program and prefer to remain anonymous. And it's easy to understand why, given all of the hurtful remarks they encountered online. Leon usually gets privacy from Mary Brown. However, the Sister Wives actress defended her child and had some sharp words for the haters in a recent interview. Check out what she said. In the summer of 2022, Leon Brown came out as transgender in public. They declared that from now on, they would only be addressed as Ia Leon Air er or Ia Leo Air er and would only use the pronouns they slash them. Leon's action was very bold because the Browns come from a very strict, religious household. They were commended by many for speaking the truth. Internet trolls, though, also voiced their opposition to them. Mary, Leon's mother, also faced a great deal of hostility and scorn for it. Nevertheless, Mary is immensely proud of her child. She also won't tolerate any offensive remarks made by online strangers. EI receive extremely divisive feedback regarding Leon, and Mary said in a recent interview with The Sarah Fraser Show. That's just the way things will be. I always value the encouragement and supportive remarks I receive, but I definitely don't value the hate that I face. According to the Sister Wives actress, hatred has a no purpose or any value. Mary would rather to concentrate on optimism and love instead. Fans of Sister Wives have previously conjectured that Mary and Leon are not on good terms. Mary used to frequently post about Leon and Audrey Chris, their partner. But Mary hasn't said much about her child in recent years. The TLC star admitted, A Leon and I have a fantastic relationship, but I don't talk about them too much because they want to be private. She declined to comment on Leon and Audrey's intentions to start a family because they prefer to keep their private life private. Mary did, however, reveal that she had a three granddogs, a from the contented pair. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, 
so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.